time now for some statements here on Joy News today. In our stories, ex-convict Ramsey of the musical reality show Stars of the Future has revealed what he thinks killed the late chief executive officer of Exopa modeling agency, Ibrahim Sima. An exclusive interview with Joy News, he recounts the events that led to Sima's death, uh, which he said could have been avoided. May he so rest in perfect peace. This man is a very good man. We were in the same block. He's in cell three, I'm in cell five. And we went to the pitch to play ball. And then he wanted to score a goal. And then the keeper also wanted to hit the ball. And then unfortunately, he hit his rib. So he had one broken rib. He didn't know. He felt the pain. And he played the ball to the end. So in the evening when they were going to pr pray, he's a Muslim. And when he tried to bow down, then he realized that no, blood was coming from his nose. So quickly we had to write. It was evening, around 6 o'clock. You know the time they pray. So we realized blood was coming from his nose, so we rushed him to the infirmary. <laughs> when we got to the infirmary, no doctor. If you are in someone's prison, it's already hell. But pray that you don't fall sick. If you fall sick, you will die. Unless God needs you for another assignment. You will die. You will die. No, you will die just like that. And it, won't, it doesn't do them anything if you die. Nothing. It doesn't tickle them. Can you imagine we waited for, for the doctor to come, doctor to come, uh, doctor didn't come. So with that pain, he had to sleep till the next day. He said they should take him to the outside hospital. They said there's no car, no ambulance. Meanwhile, there are people, officers in the prison yard who had private cars on their own. And this man I'm talking about is not somebody who you can assume that when you open the gate for him, he will run away. You understand what I mean? No, he's not that kind of guy. So they could have at least somebody should have, could have opted, oh, come on, sit in my car, chain his, hang off his hands and legs, or put him in my car and let's go. At least that would do. They had to wait till the next day. The next day, it should have been early in the morning at least. Do you know that when, when you have an internal bleeding, you don't need to drink water or something? Yeah, yeah. That because the night was long, he had to drink water. So the blood, the blood started Free, chilling out inside him. So when they when they got him out, they now took him to the hospital nearby in Insawam to sit there for another couple of hours until the doctor comes. And the doctor only came to let them know that this case, this this uh, issue is bigger than him, so they should take him to Death Seven or Kolibu. So he was on the way. He died. That'll be all for entertainment here on Joy News today. My name is Becky.